name is John the YouTuber, and today this is going to be day two in Thailand, volume three, 2017. And today we're just going to, you know, get stuff ready and then go shopping a little bit because we just arrived in Thailand. You can see that was it. So wait, wait, wait. Okay, so it is currently, we got to talk over the band in the background. It's like next on the top right there. But that's the AC. Um, it's currently about 9 or 10, 30 in the morning. You can see the back over there, Thailand behind me. Hopefully people don't think I'm crazy filming outside. So you guys, remember to like, sub and share. Without further ado, let's get right into this vlog. Okay guys, I'm back. So right now we're on the top of the hotel. You can see the background over there. Let's smear it up a little bit more. I don't know if you can see it, but yeah, it's kind of bright right now. And my dad's over there, we're on. Okay guys, right now we're in the gym. Over there, we got some weights and stuff over there. The mirror. Hey guys, now we're in a different area. Right here, right? this is a wall. It's the pool right there. Right behind me, right there. It's a nice pool. Right now it's not crowded at the moment. And after the mall is right over there. Wait, wait. Right behind me. So that's one of the malls at Seacon. We're gonna be going there later on. So you guys can see it. And they have a Wonder Woman post in the back right there. Okay hey guys, so me and my dad we're just walking to Shikan Mall right now because it's like literally like right there. Like because like the video yeah. is like it's been on the way and that's yeah, like right behind me right there. And I wanna watch, watch out because there's a bus coming. So we decided to walk instead because you can see all the traffic and the cars are moving like really really fast. And then the Wonder Woman booster is right there. Wonder Woman right there. And then we can just walk right there. It, it's over there. So we'll, we'll be right back. And also at malls, they have a bunch of these shrines where people go and worship the, um, the Thai gods and goddesses, and then also the king. And so now we're gonna go inside. So then the malls um, open up around like 10 to 10:30 ish, just depending on like what day it is. And then you know, just like your ordinary malls, like they open and close either around like nine or seven or eight and stuff. So right now we're gonna go get some breakfast and go buy some other stuff that we need. You can see over there. Hey okay guys, right now we're at the food court. You can see you know, a bunch of the restaurants and stuff you can get to. Um, sometimes at the food court, so you can uh, use coupons and that you have to pay for using the time money called bod. So Dad, what do you have? Mushroom, sweet. Sour pork and fried chicken. So if you guys can pick up the audio, oh yeah, mushroom, uh, and then sweet and sour pork. 60 baht, about $1.80. Dollar, dollar so um, that was 60 baht, and that's about, in, in US dollars, um, less than $2 for this. Because you know, using Hawaii, the plate lunch and stuff costs a lot of money, that's why. And so I got, I got um, boiled eggs, I got some watercress, and then some pork. Pork soup. Pork soup. So right now we're, we're gonna go eat. And right now it's um, about it's almost lunchtime, so about 11 to 10. So we'll, we'll be right back and we'll enjoy this delicious food. Okay guys, so um, this is the new part where they um, renovated the whole area. And this is what it looks like now. 
and then that's the new movie theater because um last time we came if you guys haven't um seen in my old vlog i'm not sure if i got that in the video but oh yeah look at have more stuff down there huh anyway so like i was saying um last time in my vlogs if you guys have been watching the ones that i have been um posting throughout the years um the thing was renovating and it's finally finished it looks really nice much different than the last time that we came here and then they have a bunch of more food places and i can smell the popcorn which smells really really good my dad's enjoying his coffee right there and we're gonna go look around some more hey guys we're back and then this is the center of the mall and each year they always have a different theme for like you know for this section of the mall and then they have like vendors and people selling stuff and exhibits and things you can learn about places you can go to in thailand you can see they have a jeep with a gun up there this guy's checking it out There's another one over there that guy's just chilling over there talking to some girl There's a bunch of food fruits and a bunch of other stuff right there and a giant train a bunch of other stuff you know my daddy's recording too and they have more restaurants yeah there's sister there too and yeah that's so much it though but after we can go check this out because there's always some interesting stuff that you can find over here that's right hey guys i'm back and we just finished eating lunch and then we just passed by this store over here and that's what it's called, called mini soul and then look at this they're gonna start over here look at you know, the monkeys and stuff it's a bunch of stuff animals they go all the way back They have a bunch of stuff, animals over here. So, there's so much. Look, look at it, it's a monkey. Look at the monkey. You guys, we're a little bit closer now to the, um, you know, the actual site of the middle area over here. So I'm guessing this is to represent like back in the, in the 1940s in Thailand. I'm gonna have to talk a little bit more louder because the people are, you know, trying to talk about announcements. I'm, I'm not really sure where they are. I think they're like somewhere over there. I think that's them talking. But anyway, there's a little talking over there, and then you see they have some vendors selling clothes and a bunch of other stuff. Um, selling clothes, so we clothes and other things like that. So my dad talking on the phone over there. And ooh, look at they got some fruits, some rambutan, oranges, um, grapefruits, and a bunch of other stuff like that. And I'm guessing this is supposed to be like during the war, because um, I saw like this poster like advertised for me. Like, yeah, you know, like those moving, movie advertisements for like movies and stuff like that. Yeah, so they had that. And I guess it's supposed to be like some kind of special. Ooh, look at like, Pizza. Ooh. So there's more food over there. And then after, oh, look. We have the Jap Japanese and then Thai. Yeah, so I guess it's supposed to be kind of representing during the war. So you can see the Japanese flag and then Thai flag. And they're screaming. <clears throat> oh my gosh, what the, what's going on? I, I don't know what's happening, but look at that. Look at the lady. I feel bad for her. She's like, okay. Uh, <laughs> What the heck? I have no idea what's going on. Just, I just heard a bunch of screaming. I was like, what the heck? I was just trying to show you guys around. Look at the food and stuff. But it's a bunch of screaming. Hey guys, I'm back. We're back at the movie theater. It's almost 6 o'clock and we're going to watch Wonder Woman. I'm not sure if you can see any of the advertisements in the back. But somebody is dressed up as Wonder Woman in the back. And we're going to go watch Wonder Woman. Yeah, yeah, I should have put the thing already. There's a lady right there. I'm not going to... Point out because it's gonna be kind of weird. Okay, guys, so we're back from the movies right now, and they we got this really big coal bucket with the Wonder Woman, and like it has like 
like different types of mur murals and stuff of the Wonder Woman movie. I'm trying not to drop this, and but the overall the movie was really really good. I really enjoyed it. Um, I thought it was you know it met to my expectations. I really enjoyed it, and also like the comic accuracy from the comics and also um, from the ratings and the critics and stuff like that. This is one of the most highly anticipated movies of the summer and it did really, really well. So um, if you guys haven't gotten the chance to watch Wonder Woman yet, go check that out. Um, go watch the movie. I recommend it to all ages.